Very <laughs> pop singer of the Texas tenors, Marcus Collins, is joining us for the entire hour. Oh, that's our very us. special guest. Wow, host. excited to be here. Wow. And I'm just going to tell you, we were listening in the newsroom to his uh -huh. soundtrack. Uh -oh. Everyone was oh, talking about were, your music. Oh my well, gosh. I, I, I have to tell you, I rarely get surrounded by this much beauty. I have to oh, deal oh, with hey. two other guys, so oh, this is so nice for so I feel sweet. like this, this should be a singing group or something. I yeah. feel like this is going to. This, oh, this is it. This I is the new band. I cannot sing or carry a tune at all. Ricky will dance. I have heard I know you can sing. sing. Gal can sing. I'll sing and dance. Can do a few moves. <laughs> and you had a sold out engagement at the Sun Coast last month. So what brings you back we to Vegas did, now? Yeah. You know, I'm doing a. Uh, I'm going to be at a benefit tonight uh, for missing and exploited children for John Walsh's organization, and I'm just so excited to be a part of it. And yeah. and uh, we love Vegas. The group loves Vegas, and I live in Burbank now, so it's just a hop, skip, and a. Right. So you'll well, be maybe performing traffic, at this huh? event with John? I'm not going to be performing, but I'm going to be attending, attending and, and, and lending support and, mm -hmm. and trying to bring awareness yeah, to the cause. Absolutely. So what are some of your tonight? career yeah. plans for this year? You know, we, we are working on another uh, PBS special. Our mm -hmm. last one that won three Emmy Awards, so we kind of have a lot to live up to now. But uh, working on a new special, new album. We have a calendar out, so we're... You know, looking forward to the future, and I've uh, got a lot of concerts on the schedule, and yeah, there's a lot of things going on. You know, we try to keep moving forward and, and uh, keep singing new music and fun yeah. things and contemporary uh, classical twist kind mm -hmm. of yeah. I love tunes. Yeah. Very yeah. nice. In your music, we were all, you know, reminiscing on the music that your kind of music sparks. You know, we're talking mm -hmm. about old movies, we're talking about ghosts. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. ghosts. Wow, oh. what a film. Yeah. How many years has it been now for Gosh, ghosts? I have oh. no oh. idea. Was that like 80s? It had to be in the 80s. It's a classic um, now. Yeah. Let's it look is. it up. Yeah, you yeah. came yeah. to I'm national attention that. because you were on America's mm -hmm. Got Talent. Mm -hmm. And how yeah. long ago was that? Ooh. 2009. 2009. Six years and now. Wow. You've seen your career explode yeah. since it's then. It's been crazy. We just celebrated our 1,000th concert as the Texas Tenor since the show. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's been a whirlwind. We, um, we were the number 10 classical artist in the world, which is just crazy. It yeah. blows my mind because yeah. me being a pop singer, I trained classically in college, but to actually mm -hmm. be called a classical singer and to be included in a company of uh, like Andrew Bocelli and right. Jackie oh. Ivanko and mm -hmm. wow. uh, the, uh, the Il Divo and the tenors, you know, it's just been Now, how did crazy. you guys come together? We uh, formed our group for America's Got Talent. Okay. We were all three really great friends and we decided hey, let's give this a shot and make some money for our families and try to do something we love. And, and it's turned into a career after... <laughs> Shows like that have really AGT, right, yeah. catapulted a lot of careers. Yeah. We know it's the last season of American mm -hmm. Idol, which blows my mind. It is, and, and we, we were proud to be included among fourth place winners like Daughtry, who's been so successful. Right. And, yeah. Terry Fader and has yes. his own show. Terry Fader right, has his own right. show, yeah. and, mm -hmm. and Jackie Ivanko has had a uh, special as well on PBS. So... Um, and Lindsay, Lindsay Sterling, she's the uh, violinist okay. who's You're had a lot of success. Right. Oh, yeah. Right. So Yeah, the list goes on. Yeah. Vegas seems to be the home after these big performances. Yeah. You guys, you know, make it big on television. It's like, come to Vegas. Then we get to yeah. really hang out with you. Well, yeah, we love Franco, it. Too. Franco, he yeah. just oh, got okay. a big one. Oh, yeah. yeah. Good company. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, we're hoping to, um, to be in Vegas a little bit more often yes. coming up in the future. We may be oh, making fantastic. some oh. announcements at some okay. point. Okay, I so. see something brewing. And by the way, Ghost came out in 1990s. So it's been some years. I think 1990, like it was just 10 oh, years ago, but that was 20 plus. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Amazing. I graduated in 92, so mm. it's <laughs> a little high school. Feels like forever ago. So right? just really quickly, what is your advice for folks uh, like you who want to make it big, bands, groups? I think it's just being true to yourself. You know, if you, if you love what you're doing, you love the music that you're performing, uh, I think that it translates to the audience and, and to be genuine. And we, we truly do care about um, the folks that come to our show. We have a very interactive mm -hmm. show and we, we love our fans and we love the music and I think that that really shows. And Ricky, let's face it, natural talent. <laughs> you know, <laughs> Which yeah. he has. Thank you, Gal. <laughs> right. Well, we're glad you're here. You're going to join us on I our trending topic. thrilled to be here. Yeah, this is so awesome. Too. Again, Perfect. this should be a group. This is it I right mean, here. come on. What right? would you call us? Right. No. The VVLs. Okay. Oh. All right. That's cool. Oh, that's yeah. VVLs. VVLs. <laughs> well, it's trending right